Alright, well, there's a lot of battery issues. Uh, so I have no idea how much of what I was doing got caught or how many times I've said this, but uh, we'll find out when I go in and deal with the footage. Uh, that little horizontal engine I fired up on gas at 10 17. It's almost 11 17, so that's been going for an hour on just a straight gasoline. I decided to start tearing down this uh, vertical engine to see if I could get the radiator off so I can reposition that. Uh, the banjo fittings are all the same. Uh, they have different rings. Uh, green ones that are thicker for the fittings on the cylinder. This off camera here. The fitting on the cylinder uses the thicker O rings. Um, and you can see I got it loose on the base. Uh, this stud holds the uh, radiator in place and also has the ground on it for the ignition system. So when I pull that out, I'm going to have to reground the ignition system someplace else. Uh, and the plan is to trim these fittings and just reroute them with the radiator uh, using flexible tubing. Um, and when I get the radiator out of the way, I'll be able to get at the bracket for the gas tank and make a plan to move that up. Um, so, that's where we are with that. Yeah, that horizontal engine got worked in. Um, it's really having a nice day of it. Uh, the lubrication on these is always a challenge. That vertical engine I kind of like because the wet sump is going to keep it lubricated. That horizontal engine doesn't take a lot of oil, but I do when I'm done running it. Tip it and drip a little oil in around the piston so that it uh, seeps in there and settles in around the ring. I also learned that this uh, cheap, um, you know, multi-way screwdriver that I got at Harbor Freight, so the cheapest of Chinese screwdrivers, the socket is the right size to get the spark plugs out, so I am excited about that because I'll be able to take the plugs out and clean them when I need to. Uh, since they do sit pretty deep in the head there. Uh, and I was worried about being able to get them out, but uh, I've lost so much footage, I can you know, stop that. Record again later, because you may have noticed, I don't do any editing of this stuff. I'm using an old camera, so it's not actually very good at recording for a while. Especially if I don't put fresh batteries. 